Now, this first video really disgusts me. I'm about to play it in just a few seconds, but let me elaborate right quick. Sound like a black chick. Sorry, I have to be a black chick. Uh, got a $30 cash out from not her man, not somebody she fucking, from somebody that admired her. And she gave them the cash out. They sent her $30. And she complained and saying they could have sent her 100 Y'all, that's why they say give a bitch dick and bubble gum. Now, if $30 can't cover your lunch, what are you eating, pig? What are you eating, cow? What are you eating, house and nitty bitch? Then you said $100 cover your lunch. Let me show you how women lie. $100 cover your lunch. Okay, seven days in a week, you might work five of them. Let's just say five. All right, so you should spend $500 a week and just lunch at work. What are you making an hour? $70 an hour? What did you bring it home a week? If you're spending five hundred in just food, imagine what you're spending in cosmetic and clothes and things like that. Bitch, you're lying. Moral of the story: I'm gonna play the video. Be thankful for whatever a nigga do for you. Whatever a nigga do for you is a bonus. He didn't have to do it. Ain't nothing worse than an ungrateful bitch. And I don't know why. If you look at cultures and societies, my favorite type of woman is a black woman. So I'm not bashing them, but I'm sorry. Y'all close your eyes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. And visualize this. This girl just got sent a $30 cash out for doing nothing at all. And she's mad that it won't 100. What ethnicity do you see in your head? Y'all comment what ethnicity you see in your head. Do y'all see her saying, thank you, thank you, thank you. Do y'all see her say? Thanks. You say, you say, thank you. Or do you say, ah, who that come from? I let y'all do the math, but I'm about to run this video. Y'all like, comment, subscribe. In the comment section is my TikTok, my Instagram, my Facebook. Y'all go to my pages. Y'all follow me. Y'all like all my stuff, run it up. And y'all do not be lenient on this woman. And if you agree with her, let me know. Y'all come in and let me know. Run up the comment section. I'll holler, gang. Okay, so y'all, story time. So y'all, please tell me if I'm wrong. So today, this dude wrote me on Instagram, and he was like, can I send you money? Let me send you money for lunch. So I was like, okay. I wrote him back, and I was like, send it. So he wrote me and was like, okay, what's your cash app? So I sent him the cash app. Yeah, I just knew I was going to open my cash app, and I was going to have at least probably about a hundred bucks. You get what I'm saying? Because, like, this I eat, and that's how much I spend on my food. Yeah, I opened my cash app, and this man sent me $30. Yeah. Yes, $30. And I'm just like, at first I'm like, damn, like, am I ungrateful? Like, am I fucked up? Like, a feeling like, like, why the fuck would you send me $30? But then I had to ask people, and they was like, nah, because I'm like, $30 is not even half a tank in my car. Like, what the fuck you thought I was going to go to Chick-fil-A? Like, I mean, I'm trying to figure out what, what, what did you think I was going to eat? It's like, when I go and eat, I eat full course meals like i order a appetizer a entree and a dessert and a drink that can't even get me two drinks like what the fuck and then this man had the audacity to write me back and say uh let me get to know you that i why the fuck do you think i'm gonna let you get to know me and you just send me 30 dollars for lunch is you dumb i mean like y'all be for real like tell me am i wrong like am i fucked up like is my head fucked up? Like, I don't even spend thirty dollars on lunch on my like I spend over that on myself. So it's like for someone to think they're gonna send me, I get that it's the thought that count, like you didn't have to send the thirty dollars, but it's like no, like nigga, I'm not that type of I'm I'm not I'm not one of them.